Hey, Lizzie, what a beautiful surprise this is. I always wanted to make sure that I spoil my brother Rotten. You truly deserve it, darling. You are the world's greatest sister, Lizzie. I love you so much. I love you too, Roscoe. You are the world's greatest brother. Man, this Kentucky Fried Chicken is so finger looking good. However, I can do with a drink. Perhaps I can help with that. Captain Man, is that really you? Yes, it sounds like you need a drink, Colonel Sanders. Well, here it comes. Wow. A tin of Pepsi. Thanks, Mr. Pepsi Man. You saved the day. No problem, Colonel Sanders. You enjoy your Pepsi now. Pepsi Man. Man, I wonder how life would be if I lived with the most gorgeous singer, Sabrina Carpenter. Do you, Sabrina Carpenter, take Joseph Garbutt to be your lawful wedded husband? I do. And Joseph Garbutt, do you, take Sabrina Carpenter to be your lawful wedded wife? I do. Great. I now pronounce you Mr. and Mrs. Garbutt, as husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Oh my god, Mr. Joseph Paul Garbutt? I love you so much. I love you too, Miss Sabrina and Lynn Garbett. I can't wait to have a child with you one day. Same here. Ah, oh, Joe, our children are so cute, and they look like us, obviously. What shall we name them? Well, Sabrina, let's call our son, Joseph Paul Garbett Jr., and we shall name our daughter, Sabrina and Lynn Garbett Jr. Ah, oh, those sound like perfect names. Second generations of me and you. Indeed. And that's how life could be if I was in a relationship with the most gorgeous singer, Sabrina Carpenter. If obviously she didn't currently date that Barry Keoghan guy, yeah, she would be a great wife to me. I don't know why, I just love Sabrina Carpenter as both a person and a singer.